Hello everyone, welcome back to Isle of the Sun 2. Now we ended just before the swim. Now this is not, this is the same level, but I just didn't want to start a new level in water. Because the air bar doesn't go back up. Now I should have really stopped the recording here. But oh well. I am recording this straight after recording Fading Light, level 3, Video Land. So yeah. But I'm probably going to upload this about a week after. So yes, I'm just going to upload, record these videos in bulk, but just upload one a week for now. Just for the time being, because I've gotten very little time to record vids. So yes, my dad's out all day, so yeah, good for me. So come up here, the crocodiles should follow. Here they are. There's one. <laughs> He's dead, there's another one. Like I said, this Charlie will be doing without using a medipack because it's just too easy. This t this level is this Charlie. So I wanted us to make it just a tiny bit more of a challenge. So yes, yeah, some Charlies don't need to have need to be made more hard challenging, but this one does for me. So yes, I'm not allowed to use medipacks. Now, that doesn't mean that if a TLA is possible, I would do it without using a med. I would just, if I have to uh, miss an item to continue the no medipack run, then I don't do it. Like I've said in Fading Light. But because I can probably get through this with no med, and oh, this, is, this is the only bit of damage I can always take. So this crocodile right here, because it's such a small space that it comes out of. And look at the little air I've got, so... You can avoid this crocodile area, you can just go back. However... Come on, I want to kill you, because you took a bit of my life. So... The only way I'm going to feel happy is if you die. If you jump over the water a bit, it does kind of bait him out because your shadow goes in the water. Oopsie. Oh well, he's not going to attack. Come on, where are you? I want to kill you. There. You dead? No. Come on, I want to kill you. I am an, I do try to get all the kills as best as I can. If an enemy just goes away from me and I have I can miss him. Like it's not a strict all kill run. But I try. So if an enemy just goes away from me and just especially the bats. I don't like bats or I just don't like flying enemies, to be honest. So harpies, mutants, enemies like them I hate. It's just it always uh, you've probably seen if you see my fading light videos, you will know why I don't like flying enemies. Man, that was that was a challenge. Fading light level three. I don't expect to have that much of a challenge from doing it. Hello! Now, something I forgot to do in the previous part, I'll do that in just a sec. Come on, you guys die. Oh, you're just going to stay alive. Nice. You have to, you have to get blown up then. If the water's not going to kill you, then I'm going to do it myself. Bye bye. So, you might be wondering why I am 
sometimes bothered about the skeletons are the only ones that I don't really sometimes let live. I do let the skeletons live sometimes. Like if you shoot the head off, that counts as the kill for me. Also, if you knock them to a hole that you can't get out of, that's, that's also a uh, kill for me. Because I'm not worried about some kills, I'm going to be honest. But most of them I do like to get. I know people will just like, oh, who cares? But it's just what I like to do. Medipack. I'm not going to use it, but I'm going to grab it anyway. Because why not? Now, I, I know I've tried to use no medipacks, but that doesn't mean... I am not going to pick them up. Where am I going? I'm supposed to be going into the water now. So yeah, I'm still going to pick all the medipacks up. Because, you know... It's not that... Because I like to pick stuff up, so yes. Yeah. I'm just going to save it here. I believe there should be some cracks in the water, but I don't know where they are. So as you can see, there's some fire up here, which is very tricky. You're going to make sure you stay in the corner for this one. I'll wait for the flame to go out, and then just run to the other corner. Wait for this one to stop. That's what I'm going to save again. Oh, I combine the uh, half or energy with the uh, pole thing to get the portal guardian. Come back to this edge of of sudden. Wait for the flame to go out. And in fact, you want to try and get it so that the flame and the other flame behind it are both out, so run now. If you keep to the back wall, you can move about safely. He just here. So that's good. Now the crocodiles, now the crocodiles are out now, so I'm going to try and kill them from here. Reason being that the way back will be going through the water. Where are you? Nope, he's gone. He's gone. Now this one is harder, so. Gonna jump on, run! Oh no! Of life there. I'm gonna. Oh no! Why? Is I sort of just went on with the level actually. No, I'm just gonna go for it again. Yes. And to be honest, I'm gonna do the same trick. So yes, I'm still not gonna save because I'm an idiot. So just try and kill these. You know, get him. If he's got blood, blood, I've got him. And that just depletes their life. See, so, in fact, I think he's waited long enough. Okay, he's dead. Now once you have the poisoned, once you've poisoned the enemies, you do have to kill. You throw a bullet on them, but the health is so low that they're practically dead. So yes, a lot of people know how the poison effect works. I see a lot of people just using the poison arrows constantly. But once, once you've hit him once with the poison, the rest just acts like normal things as far as I'm aware. So yes, yeah, so grab the secret, which contains two, one of each shotgun and some crossbow bolts. And I'm not sure what the kind that was, but just grab them anyway. Hello, yes. Oh, it's going to be. There was, there's more than one of these skellies, so 
I am going to uh, explode him. Oh, that was explosive, it looks like. There you go. Just kill them both in one hit. That's the best way to do things. So, yeah. So, if you come up here, you will notice that there's a low water level. We will raise the water, so that's fine. But push the button, and that shows us the service, so we can access that now. However, we need to raise the water so that we can get out again. Now I love this kind of thing where you just what raising or lowering water, but it's just to uh, escape. Yeah, I love that. It's kind of nice. Oh, I love swimming too. Swim, 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 swim. Wish, wish when I swim, I could. Swim. We don't see my oxygen meter like in real life. That would be so weird. I don't know why I just said, said that, but who... Never mind, doesn't matter. So now, we need to go and use that doodah that we just got. Doodah? Doodah is just what I call everything thanks to uh, some... Look at me. Thanks to this uh, person from work. So you always say do that, meaning anything. So if you come from here, because it's time, you know, so there's a door there. But if we need to get out of this level, I forget where this is. I think it's through here. And I've noticed that we can now get up here. I don't know if you could get up here before actually. But we can get up here now, so grab the medipack if you gonna I am gonna grab it but I am not going to use it. As we all know by now. Portal Guardian. So that opens up that door, so it's time to go for another swim. So yes, I am recording this a week early, a week earlier when I'm uploading it. So let's swim through here. There's a door there, just... There's a lever. There's another door there. But one of them to the door. There's a lever around here. Somewhere's the lever. Where are you, lever? What the hell? Oh, you're over here, aren't you? So there's also an airspace. No where to pull out, it's just up here if you want to breathe and breathe is what we will do so here there's the lever pause the lever <sighs> tired swim through and around and around again I believe this is n so that door is there still closed. Where did I come from? I think it's. I think I have to go back this way. There's a door there that is now being blocked, so let's go move back. I think this is a different one, so this is a different area. It looks the same, but I promise you, this is a different switch. 
I think, if I remember rightly, if I've done this correct. Now I'm going to find out that I've done this wrong. Have I gone the wrong way? I've gone out the wrong way, stupid silly me. You know what, I'm going to go back and get my ear filled up. Yeah, I was supposed to turn the opposite direction. It's just when you come out of areas, it just disorientates you. Well, that's just come out here. Just let your air bar fill up. Stupid cow. So I swim through here again. Not a lot, not a lot to do. Not a lot to talk about. So yes, once you. I don't want to be in here. Swim this way, Lara. Messing, Lara's messing up on her own. So now this door's open. We can now come up here. Grab the ammo. Because we're going to need shotgun ammo for sure. But we're not going to need it. We get plenty of ammo medipacks. In fact, how many medipacks have I got? Twelve small, five large. And you've seen how small these levels are. That door opens on approach. Time to go through it. That's the end of this level, so take it easy guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.